Let us now study about the response of diamagnetic materials to external fields. We already studied about the phenomena of diamagnetism. Say we are given with a diamagnetic material block. Say this is a diamagnetic block, and in front of it a magnet is placed, or a magnet is brought closer to it. Then the magnetic field of this magnet, as soon as it is applied onto the block, we know that in diamagnetic material, every atom or molecule has net zero dipole moment. But as soon as the magnetic field is applied in an individual atom, small or miniature currents are induced due to the effect of applying external magnetic field. So in this situation, every atom or molecule will start behaving like a magnetic dipole, of which the dipole moment is induced in the direction opposite to that of external magnetic field. So this produces its own magnetic field in the direction opposite to the external field. So this block will repel the magnet, or this magnet will experience a repulsive force due to the induced magnetic dipoles in the block. So here we can write about diamagnetic materials. When external magnetic field is applied. To a diamagnetic material, miniature currents are induced. Actually, these are effective currents because every atom or molecule have their revolving electrons, but their overall magnetic moments were cancelling each other. That's why the net magnetic moment of every atom or molecule was zero. But now these miniature currents are induced because the individual magnetic moment of every electron will get changed, which will result a net magnetic moment in opposite direction. So for this, we are writing miniature currents are induced in material which produces. A magnetic field in opposition to external magnetic field. This is the phenomena which takes place when external magnetic field is applied on a diamagnetic material. Now we can also write down some important notes about the phenomena of diamagnetism. The very first point is diamagnetism. Is a weak phenomena. That means due to the lattice structure, whichever dipole moments are induced in the material, these are not very strong. So the magnetic field produced by the block is relatively very small compared to the external field. So the force experienced by the diamagnetic material and that of the external magnet are relatively small. The second point, which we already written the previous section here, also I can write that almost every material has diamagnetic character up to some extent. A diamagnetic material is the one in which we have studied the net dipole moment of every atom or molecule is zero. But even if some dipole moment exists, then also this phenomena will be there, but it cannot dominate the existing dipole moment. That's why we can't see that other materials will also repel. So in this situation, diamagnetism is a weak phenomena, so it cannot supersede or override other characters. But we must write that almost every material has diamagnetic character up to some extent in its atom or molecules.